Dear Father Alphonse, the Regional Superior for Africa Madagascar and the Board Member of DBTEC Africa. Dear Father Haile Mariam, the Provincial Superior of Ethiopia Eritrea. Uh, dear Father Patrick from the Youth Ministry Department. Dear Economists, PDO Directors, Youth Ministry Delegates, Dear PTVets, JSOs, my colleagues at uh, DBTA, all other invited guests who are following this meeting online from different parts of the world, once again, good morning. Most welcome to DBTA Annual General Meeting of 2021. As the operations of DBTA keep expanding more and more, more and more areas of ministry in the provinces are getting involved. Unless and until there is a true cohesion, interaction and communication within the various provincial departments and with DBTA, we cannot achieve our common mission of reaching out to the young people through our Tibet centers. From this year, we have decided to have two general assemblies. The major one in March and the second one in September. It was decided to have the major one in March so as to align the annual plans of DBTA office and the Tibet activities in the province. This will be also the opportunity to plan the Tibet activities in the provinces, especially for the office of the PTVET under the guidance of the Youth Ministry Delegate. The second one will be in September and will be online only. It's a pity that all the ZTVETs are not present due to various reasons, but they would be following proceedings online. There are also other people, many others, who will be following the meeting online. We will have people from Rome, from Monto, Sam, and DBTEC ASEAN. <coughs> Besides all the planning, inputs and discussions, I believe that personal interaction helps to build relationships and through it, the network. This time, we also have a moment of team building activity. This is part of the process of bringing us together as a team with a common aim with a common goal at the service of our young people. This will also be a great opportunity to learn from one another, especially through the sharing from the Youth Ministry Department. There will be many side meetings between DBTA, that is members of the management team and the staff of DBTA, and the representatives from the different provinces. We are not able to do much of travels to the provinces during this time of the pandemic from DBTA. Therefore, these meetings with the teams from the provinces help us to understand better the situation on the ground and even uh, things we can do together. There will be sufficient group work that will help our learning process. And so let us make use of this opportunity to build the network, its capacities, and ultimately to direct all our efforts to the young people in our training centers. During this General Assembly, as usual, we will have some interaction from Don Bosco Mondo and they will be speaking to us about the ongoing projects and future project prospects for the provinces. We will also have 
the presentation from Father Patrick from the Youth Ministry Department in Rome. We need to be aligned to the congregational guidelines and priorities. Data is important for any organization to plan and move forward. We really have the desire, great desire to have a management information system set up for DBTA and its members. It's a big dream and a huge task. We are planning and moving in that line. That is why we will have inputs on data management within the DBTA database. We will also have other moments of data collection during this meeting. Finally, let us also avail ourselves for the provincial level meetings with the DBTA management and with the DBTA staff. This will help us to get a deeper understanding of the situation on the ground to know what you expect from us as well. Once again, a warm welcome to this meeting. Special greetings from the province leadership of AFEM and from the management and staff of Don Bosco Tech Africa office. Thank you very much and enjoy your stay in Nairobi and wish you all a good, pleasant and fruitful meeting. Thank you very much.